stock and rape is one of these things that's really needed on farms in order that we can you know basically utilize as much pasture as we can which will help us to drive the profitability now as we increase stocking rate obviously we do increase risks to, to, to nitrate loss that can be mitigated by good management so things like adequate slurry storage which is a, is an issue on some farms precision use of fertilizers good soil fertility those are the big ones okay and th those make a big difference so that we can operate at a high at a highish level of stocking rate while also reducing the risk of nutrient loss okay that's that's the big one so we need to separate out stocking rate from the practices that can make a difference to, to water quality it depends on the region that you're in but i think if you take it on a european scale or european context water quality in ireland is quite good there's obviously parts of the country that have that have issues that they're at moderate moderate level or maybe lower than that but we do have quite a number of water bodies that are at a high level and I, I know we spoke earlier today about how do we even define uh, water quality so there's a, there's an issue around that too but I would say we have we're not in a terrible place we, we have some very positive stories but we have work to do as well there's no question about that obviously areas with free draining soils have a risk on, on nitrate more heavier soils the risk would be on more on, on phosphorus so in this part of the world in, in County Longford on the on the Calvin border phosphorus would be would be an issue maybe more in the southeast it's a nitrates question but it's very very catchment dependent so we can't say that one county is good or one county is bad it really has to go water body by water body